on how to lace an eye web, a little bit different than uh, how many folks do it. So if you watch uh, Dirty 30 Tennessee, awesome videos, but this is just a different, uh, different way, different technique, because uh, not every single eye web has the space that a lot of the Wilsons and Rawlings have. So we're gonna go over that to where your glove is gonna look like this. All right, so we're gonna be doing this on a beautiful Emery Rocky Top glove that we did last year. Um, and so what you're gonna need is two needles and about three and a half feet worth of lace. Um, some people can do 3 16 some do quarter. This is 7 30 seconds, uh, but you'll, those are the two big supplies you're gonna use. Something else you're gonna see me use in this video is I use these forceps. They're a little bit rounded on the nose. So this way I can kind of uh, prep the hole before I put the needle in. All right, so we're gonna start right here, okay? Other videos or other techniques, you start here and then you come around and do a bunch of turns through here, leaving a lot of uh, lace in the bulk right here. Some webs don't support that, so you're gonna start right here and then we'll go from there. All right, so you're gonna take your lace and your needle, you're gonna go from here to this hole right here, not poking through this hole. You're going to go on the inside liner. All right, it should look like this. All right, notice how we're not going through to the palm side. Let's do the liner. And we're going to pull it through. All right, it should look like this. And we're going to repeat the procedure with the other side. All right, so looks like this. Now you can kind of pull and tug in with either side to get the right tension that you're looking for, looser, tighter, whatever you want. We're going to keep it about right there. I'm not very scientific with it. I just kind of get it to where it looks good and has a tension that I think feels right. All right, next step, I'm gonna go from here to here and then popping out this other side right here, okay? All right, should look like this, okay? Again, pull for the tension that you want and I go straight into the other side so this way I can maintain the right amount of tension that I'm looking for. So we're gonna go from here to here. All right, so now you should have your first layer of X's, okay? Got about the right tension that we're looking for here. Doesn't need to be super tight to where you're deforming it. Recommend always getting this top part set first, and then you do this, all right? And then we're gonna repeat the procedure. You can start on either side, but you're gonna go under this lace in here, and you're gonna pop out on the shell side. I'll show you in a sec. All right, so now that we're done, looks pretty good. Double layer X's, all right, popping out right here. And what this does, again, is some of the lacing patterns on other gloves, the webs are a little bit wider right here, so you can fit the multiple passes of lace through here. This kind of minimizes that, uh, puts the, the, the bulk in here versus throughout the entire thing. Uh, and it kind of makes it easier to get the same amount of tension throughout because you're working on both sides simultaneously. So give it a shot, let me know what you think in the comments.